<laughs> All right, now let's yeah, let's let's make some comparisons here, okay? Yeah, ain't gonna be nothing same about this. All right, no, yeah, it, it's a likely story, you know. I mean, you gotta say you got drugs in your system somehow. You know, you might as well say it happened when you were at work. Just, you know, standing beside them. Yeah. No, no, you know, it doesn't work that way. Even when people are cutting the shit and dealing with it themselves, it don't fucking work like this, okay? You ain't gonna get it like this. This, this, this shit right no, here, watch. Uh, no, Just watch. He the bullshit. Screen. Off of the, uh, Watch the it. apartment. This is some bullshit. And it looks like you're trying to get in the window, so it's a temper. Yeah, we have a screen on the way to start. Yeah. This yeah. whole thing is bullshit. Yeah, that's where we're at. It's gotta be. Right. It's stable. Yeah, we'll, we'll be, once we, All yeah, just, just hang out with him. Yeah. We'll be on our He's got, right. he's got to come up with an excuse how it got in his system somehow, right? Are you starting with me five yet? Oh. Uh, I'm sorry. Yeah. Just, okay. just touching it? Whatever? What? No, no, no. And then... Pay attention and watch how he oh, acts. Okay. Oh, okay. No. And the dude's saying three oh, times. Oh. Yeah. That's not Everything seems to be going relatively smooth for the officers on this case. However, not long afterwards, the deputy seems to be affected by an alleged dose of the opioid, causing him to suddenly collapse and remain unresponsive. Paul 6, turn me left 41, my partner. You alright, dude? Paul 6, code cover. Hey, dude. Let's go. You want to get it? Yes, code cover. Code cover for 91, Paul 6, kill me. Paul 6, 91, 41, uh, code 3. Cover. You never find a five minutes. Breathe, buddy. Breathe, breathe. Breathe, breathe. It's alright, Paul. Breathe, breathe. 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 You think he went through fucking three of them? I'm not gonna do that then. And how I'm need being all gentle, trying to be all gentle with him and shit. Give me the air, I need Narcan. I've already administered two. I'm touching it? Come on. People will be fucking flatlined and one of them will get them straight. You're telling me just by touching it, he needs three? Are you fucking kidding me? Yeah, how is he sitting there saying he's sorry if he's going <laughs> and choking? Huh? How's he talking? Oh shit, we need to just from him fucking punching it or being on the side. That's bullshit. Okay, I got you, five not letting you go. Even those who are ingesting it themselves don't need that much. Okay, okay, those who are fucking flatlined don't need that much. Okay. Right. Look at me, look at me. So who the okay. fuck are You're they trying to kill? Don't be sorry. Just focus on breathing, okay? You're doing good. Just keep focusing, buddy. You're doing great. Yeah, I'm holding his head up. Hey, Dave. You know what to be sorry about? Okay? You're okay, Dave. Babying him. Wow. Wow. 
can't free myself. See how the pants out, okay? Hands are trying to pull He's got. So I don't think he's going to be able to reach his head there. It's alright. I'll just. I'll hold. I'll hold. Your breathing feels better on your side. We can really knock over, okay? Do you think it was a dope or do you think you were having a heat exhaustion? No, it was good. No, I hit it. I like. It's in the trunk. It's it's in that clear plastic bag right there, okay? It tests a positive. His pulse is good. I don't have any. Your pulse feels great, alright? Good, normal, normal rhythm. Clear your teeth, Um, I did two. After okay. how many Narcan? Yeah, I'm just touching it. No. 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 He's dirty little cheater. Alright, here. Alright, now. Here, here, here. Let me show you another one. <laughs> Let me show you another one. Put this guy out. <laughs> dude, dumb for him. Yeah. He's like flat. Lay down, dude. Stop. Lay down. Dude. Wait. Wake up. I'll let you get in the fetal position. That's good. Run. 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 Goddamn space bar. To try and treat the victim. Hey, dude. Yo, bro. Mm, nice. Hey, bro. Hey. I'm mean, fucking flatline, dude. Look at him. Look at him. One Yo. hit. <sighs> Look how they're treating the officer him. Applies Narcan, a spray that helps reverse the effects of an overdose. And while this is taking place, no. paramedics one, in hopes of administering first aid to the dying man. Hit. It now becomes a race against time. Him breathing once okay. again. Yeah, oh. now, and then look at his behavior after the fact. First, yeah, look, I don't know. I want you to compare. My phone's dying. I want you to compare these. I'm kicking the nuts either. Yeah. I'm going to be pissed if you do that. Lay down, dude. Stop. Lay down. Dude. Well, they're treating him. Right. Wake up. I'll let you get in the fetal position. That's good. Run. Run. Oh, he just got out of the hospital. Huh? Yeah. Cool. Run. 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 Right there, man. Let's, let's Let me remind you, so this guy was flatlined. The man is Robert and appears to be flailing around, possibly from shock. And hit him However, once. Down, with the narc about what one. He been taking. Yeah, I think I'll get good for you, Robert. I'm gonna leave him. It's all right, brother. Explain the cop. Yeah, yeah, you tell me. You were all but dead. What'd you take? Do you not man? see a fucking difference? Because I sure do. I see a you difference do, in the administration. I see a difference in the patients, I see a difference in the care, I see a difference in the withdrawal, I see a difference in the flailing, I see a difference in all of it. I the choking, and when he finally first started talking, he can't do it, come on now. Ain't a bit of it the same. Because the shit with the cops, you guys, it's fucking staged, I'm telling you. Some story they come Ooh. up with probably to try and figure out a way how it got in the system. I gotta come up with a story of how he got drunk in the system. Oh, you go that way, Or it's a stage video to scare the younger ones. You know, I see idiot trying to, if they're trying to run some narrative because of stage that video really to help benefit their narrative. But the proof is in the pudding. All you do is try to just shut up and watch, and you look at the difference in the way they treat him, and the way they treat the other guy, and the way they respond. Yeah. Completely different. The go off on anything. Here's someone who cares to hear anything else I'm about you, bitch, and buy a book in two takes closer looks at. You know where to find that subscribe button.
Hope you like Burton too, and you will. I locked up on some bogus felony charges and lost everything. What? I lost Who's my this car, guy? my job, oh my, my girl, God. And my pride. You to poor top bastard. It all off, so much had changed since I was last on the streets that I applying know, for right? a new job and finding a place to crash was way harder than I thought. Even my yeah, mama friends, didn't want me they, at home they, and they told me to dirty. figure it out on my own. With only a hundred bucks Mom. in my pocket and a cell phone, I knew I didn't want to be sleeping under no bridge. So I had to figure it out and fast. That's when I'm walking down the street when one of my old homies pulls up. He tells me you hop tell in you to jump and start chatting like, like old times. I told him about my struggles and that if I couldn't find a place to right. crash or a job to rack up some dope. Oh yeah? And halfway out the state, people turn around and ask me if I put out. And I said, what do you mean? She says, what do you think I mean? And I got this look on my face like, no. And she's like, oh, Rick won't like you then. I'm like, what? What do you mean? I don't do that. I got worried. So I ended, I ended up, I wound up calling my mom and letting her know that I, I was in a different state. Yeah, I was 19. That was the last time I ran away. It was done. Yeah, I wasn't just running away from... The house, I was running away from everything, running away from all of it. Trying to find a way to better myself for me. Yeah, I've tried so many times. Nothing ever works out. Nothing ever works out. Uh, you you see the differences, out. though? They do you see the differences in two? Yeah, now you hear he's puking now. How come that cop wasn't puking? situation. He was not charged for possession of illegal substances, but he's just one of the many victims who are affected by the alarming rise in highly dangerous opioids that are claiming the lives of Americans on a daily basis. And thankfully, the officer was able to save Robert's life. After administering one dose of Narcan, and somebody needs like flatline. Okay? Okay? You do the comparisons yourself. And then in this one, in this one, they were, she was smoking fentanyl. And they are in the house and in the room where the cloud was smoked. And none of them are dropping. None of them are overdosed. They're in the room where the cloud was. None of these people are dropping and needing no Narcan. No, no, are they? Are they? She says that she stole her wallet. Reminds me of a joke my brother once told me. He said, what's the difference between a crackhead and a meth head? I said, what? He said, a crackhead will steal your wallet. A meth head will steal your wallet and help you look for it. <laughs> it's good stuff. Good stuff. But yeah, no, I just wanted to add this little bit right here to the end of this little, you know, the fentanyl video. Yeah. Yeah. Click that subscribe button and stay tuned. See what else I might be pitching about next. I got some skits to, to post. Yeah, that's right. Because that's what's up. Right here is where he found, when the, one of the cops found one of her fentanyl pills. Okay. And she's swearing up and down and it wasn't there. Oh, they planted it. They just, oh yeah, the cops just happen to know what the fuck you had out there, right? Yeah, they just got, they just got that pill on that. No, no, you know, people just kill me sometimes. I mean, I'm sure the cops have had plant, had, had their moments where they, there's been cops planting the shit. But in this case, I mean... How's the cops supposed to know exactly what pill you got? And they just got one right there on on hand, you know? 
she must have dropped it and not fucking even realized that she dropped it. And right here is where she, this is where she busts herself, okay? She's sitting here lying, trying to say that she wasn't doing anything. She was she, no fat, no, she wasn't smoking nothing. No shit like that was going down, right? Now she's saying that that pill, she's like, oh, that wasn't there. You know for a fact that it wasn't there. You planted it and yada yada, this and that. Look, look, look what she says next. Boom. Right there. I wasn't smoking in here. Oh, oh. So you were smoking in the other room? Is it because you were smoking in the other room? Is that why? Because it was, it, was, it was the other room you were smoking in? Not in that room? Huh? Because you must have dropped it, honey. You must have dropped it. Face it. You dropped one. Yeah? Yeah. She dropped one. She must have. My daughter painted those. Neat, right? Yeah? Neat, ain't they? Ain't they cute? Ain't they super cute? <laughs> I got you on the cat climber. Okay. Oh. <laughs> Can you see the difference? Can you tell what I just did? Can you tell what I just did? <laughs> He had some britches hanging out his dresser, and they looked tacky, so um, I stuck them in there. I just, he just stuck them in. All right, no. I just want to say, okay, I'm not, I'm not trying to say I'm pro no okay? I'm not saying that. that. That's not what I'm saying. That's not what this is, okay? Um... I'm saying it doesn't need to be as scary as all that. Like, if if somebody, I'd hate for an accident to happen or something. If you find out you're in the same room as, as that shit, you don't need to freak out and think you need to escape the room, escape room for your life, because just being near it is going to kill you. No, 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 that shit was staged. Okay, now, from... My own personal experiences and shit I saw. Now, look, look, I'm no longer the person I was 15 fucking years ago, okay? I'm not that person anymore. But back in the day, when the shit was brand new, I seen somebody take one of those pouches, you know, the, pou the pouch, the patch, the patch. You put on the patch and it absorbed it. He ripped that packet open and he sucked all that juice out of it. And he drove home like nothing on it. Now, now, some people have a higher tolerance than others, okay? No, though it's not recommended to be taking six to eight pills at a time, that's not to say it doesn't happen, okay? It's easier than you think to build up. A tolerance to that shit. Please don't judge me. I'm no longer that person. Okay? I, I've changed. Others can too. I mean, your recovery is possible. You just really got to want it for yourself. And I can give you a reason to want it. If you, if, if you learn from my mistakes and don't make the same mistakes I did... Then maybe you won't wake up to your face being folded in half. Because I'm telling you what, it's scary, scary feeling. And it sure is. You haven't waking up with a crease going down the side of your face. The fuck? Because your pillow smashing. Man. I mean, I've had some scares. Falling asleep on at the keyboard. And waking up with a line across my face. You don't want it. You don't, you don't want it. Okay? You don't want it. And then you've got these fuckers where, you know, you ever notice, you ever wonder how so many people are dying from something they're not even doing? Hmm? Yeah. How are they getting them in their system? Nobody's going to waste that shit squirting it on weed. It's not on weed, okay? I don't know who the fuck.
them up with that. That that ain't happening. No, they they press it into fake pills that are made out of like Tylenol and shit, and just like a little drop of fentanyl because that little itty bitty drop will get that person out of pain and it'll keep them coming back. Not taking an account for the people that end up taking six to eight little drops when they take their handful that they're usually used to taking. And then that much of that unknown substance in their system is what makes them fucking flatline on people, okay? On them, but it makes them flatline on themselves. That's the shit that's making them flatline. <laughs> And it's a scary thought. It really is. Okay. Now, what I want to say about the video. When the cop was talking to the lady about the, mo the mother. And she was talking about them being blue. Okay. They mentioned them being blue with an M on one side and a 30 on the other. Or did they say 20? I'm I'm no. That, that's a rock set. That, that, that was a fake pill. A fake rock is that painkiller, fake oxycodone, a fake oxy. It was a fake, it's a rock is that. It's, it's like an oxy, but it also has a little tiny bit of substance in it called hydrochloride. And those who, you know, the, the ones who run it, they say that the hydrochloride stings a little bit. I wouldn't know. I've never done this shit myself. But I know people had a lot of friends in my past, and I know a lot of people that fell victim to the same type of stereotypical setbacks from out of their own childhood with their own issues, okay? Sometimes you're just a product of your environment, okay? Yeah. That girl probably knew that it wasn't a real painkiller. You know, because since she was smoking it, because they, they know they get smoked their fentanyl. I don't want to be smoking no oxy, though. You don't want to be smoking that shit anyway, but even if you did and you're really smoking it, ain't gonna do nothing for you. Sorry. But, um, you know, I don't eat all those painkillers and shit no more. I don't, I don't do all that junk no more. Dude, I got introduced to Lyrica. And it's, I mean, I don't like being able to not breathe, not being able to breathe right in the morning until it kicks in. Hubby wants to swear it's the Siggies. If it was the Siggies, I'd be like that all day. But I'm not. Mm -mm. It's just in the morning. So, if, I mean, if... Not just in the morning, it, it's just until, oh God, it's, see, sorry. it's just until, it's just until the lyrical kicks in. An old friend of mine was trying to buy like 150 of um, these yellow pills, you know, the Norcos, they're, they're like a Vicodin. But, you know, they've got the 325 milligrams of the acetaminophen, which is basically it's just Tylenol. It's just Tylenol. Then the bigger regular Vicodins, you know, they'd have 500 milligrams. And the extra string ones have 650 milligrams of the Tylenol. But the other shit, it's, it's 10 milligrams, 5 milligrams, 7.5 milligrams. There's no 750 milligram, okay? You people in the South, it's not 750 milligrams. That much hydrocodone would kill a person. Okay? There's a, there's, there's a fucking decimal point in there. Okay? Okay? It's a 7.5, 7.5, not 750. There's a big, huge difference. Big difference. You know they even call it an eighth, a half, and, and a quarter ounce of weed. Just weed. Mm -hmm. Quarter ounce of weed down south, they want to call it a nick. I just said, buddy, I got five bucks. Go get me a nickel bag. I got five dollars for you right here. They tried getting fifty dollars out of me. Where would you get that from? 
A nickel is half of a dime. Anyway, oh my gosh, holy shit, I'm gonna run out of fucking time again. What was I saying? Oh yeah, he was trying to buy 150 of them. The little yellow ovals. And it says 36 on one side of the dash, and then it says 01 right next to it on the same side of the pill. But the number one was so far away from that zero. And I was like, whoa, buddy, you don't want to be buying these. You don't know what's in them. Because I'm telling you what, I don't think it's a Norco. I don't think it's hydrocodone. It, one, was awfully fucking light. And two, why was it white? They were even narrow. They were more narrow. I'm like, dude, they didn't start making them smaller. There's just it's the same amount of shit in there. The 36 only. Go ahead, look it up. Go ahead, go ahead and look it up. Go ahead, look it up. Yeah, look up a Watson 385 too while you're at it. Or uh, M350, uh, M357, M358, and M359. Those are all two. They're all the same. They're all the same. It's just a different manufacturer. Yeah, I, I was not a pharmacist. I... I don't want to see what I was. It was in the past, okay? Okay? And I I did my time, and it's all said and done, and it's over. It's over, and I've grown up, and I've changed. I've stopped doing such things. I've seen the error of my ways. I've raised a kid that doesn't do the shit themselves. I think I've learned from my mistakes. Okay, please, others out there in the world, heed my warning and learn from my mistake. Okay, you don't want this. You don't want this. My nose is forever changing. It's, it's terribly scary. If you are going to do that, do something else. Now, my post-its are strictly for, you know, writing, like, lists for... Shopping lists, whatever. But rather than using a dollar, I would keep these post-its. I would, and not these ones, but I would keep post-its in my purse, and even even trying to be clean about it has fucked my shit up. Okay, it happened so fast. It happened so fast, and once it once it started, there was no stopping it. And I've always been too ashamed to tell a fucking a doctor. I'm too ashamed. I'm too ashamed to tell the doctor. I'm scared. I've never told them. I've never told anybody. And, and my family didn't even know. Just you guys are the first ones I've told. Just the YouTube. Click the subscribe button and if you care to hear anything else I might be bitching about. Because that's what's up with boy. Squirrely Brigade from the past. The Squirrely Brigade from the past. What's up there, Squirrel? I miss you guys. Been real. And we out.